what's up? Arts here, and welcome to a new Black Ops 3 video. Now, in this one, I'm actually going to show you how you can use the M27 in multiplayer. Now, keep one thing in mind, don't try to fire the weapon, don't try to reload the weapon, and also, don't try to zoom in, because if you do that, you'll lose the gun itself, and of course, you're going to have to do the glitch all over again. Now, of course, that doesn't take too much time, because in fact, this glitch is pretty easy, but we ain't got time for that. We ain't got time to waste. So, with that being said, let's get to it. Now, for starters, you want to go to multiplayer, you want to go to create a class, and you want to make sure that you have two empty class setups. After that, you can back out, go to either your friends list or your recent players, and make sure you find someone who has some time played in the campaign. So look for someone who's ranked 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, doesn't really matter all that much. Go to their combat records, and then of course, go to their campaign combat records. Now, next up, you'll see these six tabs. You've got weapons, equipment, cybernetic combats, collectibles. I want to say accolades, I'm not too sure how to pronounce that. And of course, also missions. Simply open all of them and back out straight away. Anyways, here we go. That's one, that's two, three, four, five, and of course, six. Now back out all the way, go back to your critic class, go to one of your empty setups, go to secondary, and under launch, you'll see the war machine, which is actually being showcased as the M27. Now this, of course, is a bit of a glitch. It's a pretty simple one, but I personally don't think that the M27 is going to return to multiplayer. Because, of course, we already have the ICR, which is pretty much an exact copy of the M27. In fact, the reload animation is exactly the same, if I'm not mistaken. And, anyway, of course, what you want to do is you want to select the war machine. After that, you want to back out. Simply copy this setup onto a different one. Doesn't matter which one. Keep to the minds. And then what you want to do is you want to reset this class setup, the original setup, back to default. Doesn't matter which one once again. And then from here on out, you can basically go ahead and look for a multiplayer match. Now keep one thing in mind, you can only join sessions in progress. If you don't join a session in progress, simply back out, because if you stay in that lobby, the game will basically crash once the map is done loading, which of course is a bit of a pain in the ass. And once again, if that happens, you're simply going to have to do the entire glitch all over again. Anyway, with that being said, let me know in the comments down below what you think about this. Also, let me know what weapons you would like to see return to Black Ops 3 in the near future. Of course, like I said before, it seems highly doubtful to me that we'll be seeing the M27 in the near future. But we've seen a ton of rumors, a ton of leaks revealing weapons like the PPSH, the Stand Gun, the MP7. So let me know in the comments down below what you would like to see return. And apart from that, if you enjoyed this video, some support, a like rating would be very much appreciated. If not, that's cool. If you want to, you can also follow me on Twitter or Facebook or Instagram. You can find all those links in the description. And apart from that, thank you all so much for watching. Thank you for the continued support. And I will catch you in the next one. Take it easy.